Hello everybody, and welcome back to the Nerdy Adventures of Dell. I am Dell, and I'm acting like a goofball. Why? Because I'm a nerd, and I can. <laughs> With all that said, um... Today's gonna be another nerdy adventure with the very random, very mysterious Jar of Fate. And the reason why I call it the very random, very mysterious Jar of Fate is because it is gonna decide what I do today. Today is gonna be a nerdy unboxing of some sort, but whether it's... Well, you'll find out. You'll find out. I'm going to mix up these papers. I'm not going to stick my hand in to influence it. I'm just going to mix them all up. Mix them up, mix them up, mix them up, mix, mix them up, mix them up. Okay, that's enough of that. I won't put you through any more torturous songs. And the unboxing shall be of... Let's see, can you guys see? Oh, look at that. Unboxing a little bit of Stratisfaction, maybe? Trish Stratus being unboxed today. Holy, I'm excited. I've been itching to unbox her. Not gonna lie. But she shall be, she shall be set down right there. I shall close the very random, very mysterious jar of fate and set it aside because its job is done today. One figure today, that's it. Um, she's luckily right here, and it is going to be Trish Stratus from the Elite Collection, uh, Elite Series 88 Trish Stratus unboxed and reviewed today. One more second, just give me one more minute, Grandpa Dell forgot the handy dandy pleasing tool to unbox Trish Stratus. Hey, it's not my fault, you young whippersnapper. You didn't tell me you were doing a video today. Ah, uh, Grandpa Dow, be quiet. It's okay, I'm not mad about it. You can't find it. You can't find it. Just use these. Okay, I'll just use these. Just use these. It's a pair of jewelry clippers jewelry wire clippers. They'll work. They're sharp. Um, I recommend for all you young kiddos out there unboxing these, cutting anything, always do it with adult supervision. It's best. Or unless you're of normal age, then go ahead and do what you want. But for the young ones, I recommend doing it with adult supervision. But enough of that public service announcement. I am going to get straight into the unboxing. Just as soon as I pop the tape. Jeez, it's stubborn. Really stubborn. And these are not the right tools to use either. But thankfully I don't have to use them anymore, I don't think. Yeah, because their job is done. Ooh, fabric tape. Thankfully it's fabric and not that plastic rubber-ish BS. First, first thing to do, always check and see if they have ties. Which this one has more tape on the cape. No tape on the cape, Mattel. Stop doing that. I like to make funny voices. It's just fun. Me being funny, I guess. Fun, having fun. And you, I also noticed that her index fingers are going from the outside in. So they're underneath this plastic. So be careful of that if you get this figure to unbox. Be very careful of that. So yeah, I am now gonna 
take her out of the booster package. Oh, ah, there goes her pink hat. No, fumbled the hat. She's trying to beat Grandpa Bell there and failing. But there we go. Ooh, I like this little entrance cape she has. It's very basic though. I thought she had like stratisfaction on her entrance cape and it's not on this. So that's a bit of a bummer. As you can see it is not on there. That is a bit of a bummer. But overall the figure so far is very sturdy. Very very sturdy. Um, it looks like the spare hands are off shade. That's kind of no bueno, just a little. Slightly lighter than the actual figure itself. The figure itself is darker than the spare hands, that's not cool. Not cool. But yeah, this is my Elite Series 88 Trish Stratus from the Elite Collection, Elite Squad, I guess you could say. Yeah. Trish Stratus, this is my daily dose of Stratus faction, y'all. And yeah. Grandpa Dell would like to say thank you for taking the time out of your day or evening or night to watch this video. Take care. Peace out, y'all. Have a great night, evening, or day.